Hello everyone. Thanks for joining me again this week. So what have I been doing this week? Well, because it's Mother's Day on Sunday, I've been trying to think of some ideas that I can just show my mum how much I love her, how much I care for her, and how grateful I am really for all the things that she does for me. Now, you want, might want to use some of these ideas too for your mum or for that special person that cares for you. So the first thing I thought of was I could make her breakfast or a cup of tea. I could make her a card, a Mother's Day card. I could give her a great big hug and let her know how much I love her. I could give her a gift. So the gift, what would I give her? Then I thought I could make her something. So that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to make a gift for my mum to let her know how much I think she rocks. So here's the things that you'll need to make your Mum You Rock paperweight Mother's Day gift. You'll need some card, stone or a pebble, some felt tips and a pencil, scissors, I've got some sticky on eyes that you might have googly eyes or you could make them, draw them on paper and stick them on. Got some feathers, some pom-poms. Now it does advise to use acrylic paint, but I don't have acrylic paint. I'm just going to use my watercolor paints and I'm not gonna add water to them. You need something to stick all the items together. I really like these sticky squares. You can use whatever you have at home, um, maybe some strong glue or double-sided tape, or anything that you have that will stick your bits and pieces together. I've got a little palette for mixing my paint in and a paintbrush. So let's get started. Start by mixing whatever colours you want. I'm just going to use some blue and I want it a bit lighter so I'm going to mix some white with it too. Next, paint every area of your stone till it's completely covered in your choice of paint. While you're waiting for the paint to dry in the stone, we can get on with the other bits and pieces from the craft. I'm going to outline this square of card just with black so it stands out. You can use any colour. Then I'm going to draw a pattern round where the stone will sit. Just a wiggly pattern. You can do any pattern you want. And then I'll write in, Mum, you rock. I'm doing this in pencil, just in case if I make any mistakes, I can rub it out. I'll then go over it with my black felt tip pen. Like I said, you could use any colour, any design. You could maybe add some flowers or love hearts. Next, we want to make the shapes for our craft's feet. A couple of teardrop shapes. And then I'm going to color those in with a black felt tip as well. Just so that it stands out. Cut those out. There we have one. to use a little bit of the spare paint to colour in the middle bits of the feet. 
and felt tip as well. You can use felt tip or paint. Next I am going to stick the stone onto the card. I'll use my Stick It Squares. And remember to place my feet in position. Don't want to forget those. There we are. Next, I'm going to stick on the eyes. Here's one eye. And the second eye. Oh, the nose is a bit big. I think I'll just trim off a little bit of the end of this pom-pom. You could also use a bit of wool for this. Oh, it's a little bit of a fiddle. There we are. We got there. I'm going to give a nice big smiley face. I'm going to put the feather bow on. I'll need some celly tape for this. There we are. Top of the head. Wonderful. Here's also another one that I made. Happy Mother's Day, Mum. I made you a gift. Oh, thank you, Heather. That's lovely. And thank you for the nice cup of tea you made me. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs>